Hello, honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. <coughs> Granny Murray's house has two at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home to. Who's here today? Well, we've got Gary and we've got Molly. But don't just sit there, let's get busy, Pickles. Because you help Granny Murray with the babies, don't you? That's a good girl. Oh, tuck them in nice and warm. And Molly, you come and give the baby a wee bottle. <laughs> Sit down, that's a girl. Well, we've got Gary and we've got Molly. But someone's missing from home today. Oh, not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Oh, it's Lisa with Raymond. Hello there. Raymond! Hiya, Granny Murray. Oh, and Lisa! <laughs> <laughs> In we come! Well, Lisa is really looking forward to going to the picnic at Castle Garden today, Granny Murray. <laughs> oh, why don't you dress Claude up as a statue in the park? <laughs> yeah. Oh, the statues are great. They're so grand. Mm, I think I prefer to be a statue sitting down. <laughs> Come on, then. What's this? What kind of statue are you, Raymond? Yes. Julius Caesar riding his horse. Well done. What a sanguine. I'm going to... Uh, true! <laughs> We've a lot to do before we go on our picnic, Raymond. But I'll get everyone to help. After all, many hands make light work. Absolutely. <laughs> oh, will you look at Claude? He's a perfect statue. <laughs> oh, Claude, how do you manage to stand so still? Here you are. Oh, thanks, Lise. <laughs> Claude, you are a real star. Oh, bye, Lise. Well, I better get to work. Come on then, let's get you going. Now remember, many hands make light work. Thanks, Granny Murray. You guys have a fun day. We'll be thinking of you, darling. Me too. Now, will you keep a wee eye on Raymond? Make sure he gets the right way to work. I'm on my way to work today Walking my shoes through the city views Stepping along, I'm swinging my arms Singing my way through the city's charms Getting there is just so fine I so enjoy my walk Time. I always know the way I go But can you show me the way I go? Hey! Okay, which way? Do I go left now or do I go right? Which way is wrong now? Which way is right? Left! Okay, left to the station I'm on my way to work today Looking this way and that away. Hello, taxi. Hello, tank. Hello, trolley. Hello, plank. Hello, lorry. Hello, bank. Which way's a smile now? Which way's a frown? Up! Up! You told me the way I go Thank you! You showed me the way I know Phew! Here we are! So what next? Ah yes! I have to get changed into my smart uniform All dressed and ready to go once more, onto the buffy car, dear friends. <laughs> Hi, Mickey John. Ah, Raymond. So why aren't you in school? I'm taking my class on a history walk along the Roman wall in Ravechester. Oh, great. It was an amazing wall, you know. It's very old and crumbly now. The people used to live along the wall in Roman times. They built it so long ago, from the bottom up, stone by stone. Oh, I hope they don't all fall. 
Well, of course not. The war lasted for years. And as I say, the ruins are still there today. Amazing, isn't it? History is just so exciting. So what can I get you? Oh, I'll have a pineapple. Oh. <laughs> That'll be a pound, please. OK, Raymond. I must just go and sit with the kids. Oh, I wonder how my kid is doing. I love to skip in River Sinking, go River Sinking, go that's for me. What have we forgotten? Apples. Apples, hope. That's a good girl, thank you. Apple juice. Apple juice, Molly. Many hands make light work. Oh. And what else do we need? Echo's cake. Of course we do. Oh, we can't forget these. They're your dad's favourite, aren't they? <laughs> Are you having fun, Daddy? <laughs> they suit you. Oh, Bobby, it's you. What can I get you? Um, bottle of water, please. Oh, yeah. I'm here to meet Mickey John and the children to help on their Roman walk. Oh, they're just at the other end of the carriage. Yeah, I can see. Actually, I'm a little bit worried about keeping the children amused on the walk. You're full of good ideas. What would you do? Hmm, well, Roman wall, Roman soldiers. Oh, well, they marched along the wall, so instead of walking along the wall with the children, you march! Get in line, soldier, and follow me! Drum, 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 Roman soldiers on the wall! Keep marching, soldier, while I serve this customer. Can I help you, sir? A banana, please. Anything else? How am I doing, Roman general? Head high, knees high. Anything else? That's 50 pence, please. Hail Caesar! Ooh. Soldier, halt! Fantastic! <laughs> I can't wait to go and tell Mickey John. <laughs> No, forward march with my work. I love my train. Very happy serving you. Oh, I talk, talk, talk all day, making special moments on my way. I'll tell a joke and toast some cheese on toast. Oh, I walk, walk, walk all day, bringing smiles and happiness my way. Being nice is what I love the most. Six is just a looking fine. All the people on the train Can I help you clear your things? If there is a problem I'll explain Oh I talk, talk, talk all day Wheeling trolleys weaving to this way I'll do a trick and make the journey quick Oh I walk, walk, walk each way Loving all the things I do each day Bringing smiles and happiness my way What can I do for you historians, then? Children are getting a bit bored. I thought you might entertain them. Oh. Right, young history buffs, line up. The tallest <laughs> beside me and the shortest at the other end. Now, Roman soldiers, when Roman general addresses you, you stand still, like statues. Right, soldiers, Roman general says, ride your horse. <laughs> Roman general says, March! Roman general says, salute! Hail Caesar! Is that all, folks? <laughs> Brilliant as usual, Raymond. Ah, Lisa, how's my wee soldier doing? Tick, 
Keep the noise down a bit, kids. There are other passengers to consider. Shh. Oh, they're really bored and hungry. Lunch. We are going to be having our packed lunches before we do the walk, aren't we, Mickey John? Lunches? Oh, no. We've got a bit of a problem, Raymond. I was so excited about the history walk that I forgot to tell the children to bring any packed lunches. So? Well, could you make the children a packed lunch to take on the walk? All of them? Oh, oh Mickey John, if you told me when we left Riversea Fingal, there would have been lots of time to make the lunches. But we're nearly at the terminus. Where did the time go? At eight o'clock, I dropped Lisa off at Granny Murray's house. Granny Murray was excited about going on a picnic to Castle Park to look at the statues. At nine o'clock, Mickey John was on board the train with his class. They were going to do a history walk. Mickey John told me everything about the old Roman wall. At 10 o'clock, Bobby came into the boofy car, worried about keeping the children amused on their walk. I solved the problem by suggesting that they march along the wall instead of walking. Marching's great fun. Around 11 o'clock, the children came into the boofy car, this time very noisy. So I entertained them. About 12 o'clock, Mickey John was reminded it was nearly lunchtime and he'd forgotten to ask the children to bring any packed lunches with them. It was then Mickey John asked me to make packed lunches for all of the children. Now remember, many hands make light work. Many hands make light work. Lots of hands helping. Lots of clean hands preparing things. That's it. You know what, Mickey John? This might just be possible. Let's get these soldiers back on their feet and moving. The first thing we need to do is wash our hands. It's a race against time. I've got to do it. I've got to do it. I've got to beat the clock before the chime. I've got to sort it. I've got to sort it. I've got to do the job on time. Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong. I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song. Do we think he's going to do it? the clock before the chime I've got to sort it He's gonna start it I've got to do the job on time Like a busy bee I'm going to beat that bong I'm gonna finish this job before I finish this song We're arriving at the terminus Have we got everything? Uh, walking boots? Check Guidebook? Check Children? Check Lunches? Check Right soldiers, forward march Right troops, three cheers for Raymond, the best buffet attendant ever! Hip hip! Hooray! Hip hip! Hooray! Hip hip! Hooray! I wonder if Lisa knows her dad is the best buffet car attendant ever. Pretend to be statues. Oh, brilliant! <laughs> oh, here, let me take your picture and we'll show Dad when we go home. <laughs> Ready? Where are you, Daddy? Hello, Raven. Hi, Granny Murray. Look who's here, Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Have you had a good day? Oh, we've had a fast day. <laughs> and are you going to say thank you to Granny Murray? Thank you, oh, Granny Murray. Oh, come here, Murray. my darling. Oh, she's been the best girl, haven't you? And it's a big thank you to you from me too, Granny Murray. I remembered what you said. Many hands make light work. It saved the day. Well, I never did. Come on, you two. You'll want to be off home. <laughs> I'm looking forward to next time. Me too. Come on, Lisa. Let's chat about our time away. 
And I suppose you want me to tell you all about my time too? Well, there was waving, greeting, hello, meeting, bye bye, closing, waking, dozing, eating, sleeping, fetching, sketching, painting, stretching, gluing, chewing, sticking up and wiping round, washing up and slushing down. Then there was hugging, squishing, walking, pushing, dancing, dusting, shooting, choosing, talking, cooking, drying, cleaning, saving, cleaning, loving, joking, losing things and rushing round. was really special about today? Well, Claude was dressed as a statue because we were going to be seeing a lot of statues in the park later on. At lunchtime, the children and I packed the picnic hamper together. We packed lots of goodies, including Eccles cakes. We had a great time in the park. The children played lots of running games. Then we put a rug on the grass and had our picnic lunch. Once we had eaten, we pretended we were statues and stood really still. Oh, it was great fun. When Raymond came to collect Lisa, he said he had made lots of sandwiches with the help of many hands. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Me too. Bye-bye, honey pie. I love you. Down to the city, the city. where the fairy folks dance the blues. Time to call on Granny Marie.